So we've all heard of the Emmys and the Oscars, but have you ever heard of the Halo Awards? Seven Angels, an award-winning theater group, started this red carpet event to honor excellence in, in high school theater all across Connecticut. Here to tell us about the red carpet event is Samina De Laurentiis, the artistic director. Welcome to Connecticut Style. Thank you. It's a pleasure um, to be here. Samina, first tell us a little bit about Seven Angels Theater. We're a professional regional theater in Waterbury, Connecticut, and uh, we're now go launching into our 23rd season. So 23 years. That's great. Um, now, the Halo Awards, they've been around for about a decade, yes. correct? This is the 10th yes. year Ten anniversary. Years. 10 years. What are you giving awards out for? Well, we wanted to create a program that would uh, recognize and honor the work of students in their high school theater programs. So c we created this nonprofit program, and uh, there's no fee for schools to participate. And it's been very exciting as we've watched it grow each year and expand and become so successful. Sure. It's, it's a great event. Um, tell us about some of the categories. Oh, we have, we have a lot of categories. <laughs> well, from um, best musical, best play, lead actor, actress, uh, all the way to uh, program art. Now, uh, the day of the awards, the night yes. of, it's filled with entertainment, a lot of activity going on? Other schools uh, who are uh, there participating in that particular Halo event, they get to perform on stage. Uh, this year we were at the Palace Theater in Waterbury, so it's very exciting for them to be on such a magnificent stage and such a magnificent theater. Uh, and they get to perform from their show, whether it be a musical production number or a scene from their play. And, uh, and then each, each night is its own event. So. Mm -hmm. Each night will have its own best musical, best play, lead actor, and so forth. Oh, interesting. Over the okay. course of the two nights. Um, we've put up some pictures of the, yes. uh, the different acts, the different performers there. Yes. Um, tell me how you come to a decision. You have a, a board of judges, I'm assuming. Yes, we have uh, 12 judges that go in to go to evaluate all the productions. So this year, I believe it's 69 productions that we went and we evaluated. And then we do our nominations, which just came out uh, last night. They were Ooh. all posted and uh, for, for all the schools. And so these judges, and then we have a meeting, and we go through the evaluations, and we determine the, the uh, nominations and the winners. Got it. Now, what's uh, the reaction from the kids? I mean, it's a big night. It's electric. Yeah. It's just, it's just wonderful. And it's, uh, it's wonderful to see them support each other, cheer each other on from uh, public, private, parochial schools. Uh, and we only honor the students. It's all about, it's totally a program that's about the students. Now, Sveen, is there an actual statue, like an Oscar or an Emmy? We have one, <laughs> which I should have brought one of our little, it's a wonderful wooden-based uh, trophy with a, with a star on top of it, and, mm -hmm. and it's engraved. And, uh, and each student, each winning student gets one. We also have a gypsy robe category, oh. which is for, uh, uh, which is based on the Broadway gypsy robe, which people can go online and see what that is. And so a chorus member, uh, gets to wear this gypsy robe that is nominated from the schools. Wow. Uh, so it's pretty cool stuff. <laughs> if that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, no, I understand. Uh, Sweena, where can we get tickets? Uh, they can call our Seven Angels Theater box office, which is 203-757-4676, or uh, also go to our website. Sounds great. All right, and all the information is right there on your screen. Just to reiterate, uh, you could check out the Seven Angels Theater. Samina, what is that website? One more time. Oh, sevenangelstheater.org. Very yes. good. Sounds like a really fun event. May 28th and? And 29th. Two nights. Two right. nights. Well, we are back here in the kitchen with all of our guests. Lieutenant, are you hungry? I'm starving. <laughs> <laughs> Sherry, tell us how you finished off these shrimp burgers. So I opened up the buns. I put a little bit of the sriracha mayo on it and some of the mango salsa, and they're ready to go. Pretty good, and we mentioned again a lot of different varieties of these we could do. Exactly. I know the crew's been eyeing these uh, for a little while, but I think it's time to dig in. Lieutenant, just give us a website where we could find some tips on boating safety. Well, you'd want to really Google safe boating uh, Coast Guard, and you'd find a number of resources there to, to get all the information you need. All right, sounds good. I think we are just about ready for Memorial Day weekend. We have burgers, we have safe boating. We just have to have the weather cooperate now, right? Yes. All right, well, let's dig in. We want to thank all of our guests, and most of all, thank you at home for watching. Make it a great day. We'll see you back here tomorrow, and we're going to enjoy lunch. Bye-bye. <laughs>